I like it. Uh huh, uh huh. That's the way. Uh -huh. I like it. Uh huh, uh huh. Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today we're doing a little grocery shopping with me slash haul, whatever you wanna call it. Um, I am in the Walmart parking lot because I decided I'm gonna do my grocery shopping here at the lovely super center we have here off of Northwest Highway. Northeast Highway? Northwest Highway. Northwest Highway. I don't usually do my grocery shopping at Walmart. I'm more of an Aldi girl, Aldi, Trader Joe's kind of girl, but we're gonna try something different. Um, I am going out of town this weekend, so I'm only shopping for the next five days, which I feel like it's just kind of like a week, I guess. That's what we're shopping for amongst just other little necessities that I needed, and this was just like a hub that would have everything. Like I need more than just groceries, so I was like, you know what, I really don't wanna go around different places, so I was like, Walmart will have just about everything I need. So let's go ahead and go shopping. Hooked on you, baby, you're golden. Time moves, I never know it is. Just can't get enough. Got me wonderstruck. It's been a minute since I found someone who makes me want to know a thing about love, but oh my God. I'm seeing stars with you. Tend to keep myself from diving in. I got fed up with the sink or swim. But oh my God, I'm falling hard for you. I keep on waiting for the hurricane to come and watch the magic that you brought away. But somehow all the colors just keep getting brighter. Yeah, I'm feeling it more every day. I think I'm. said I was like oh I'm gonna be out of town this weekend I'm not gonna buy that much stuff I should have known myself but it's fine so now I'm gonna give you guys a little haul of everything that I got we've got lots of bags up in here first of all okay so the trip I'm going on is the beach did I say it was the beach I might have just said it was a trip I need another beach towel that doesn't say Pi Fi on it no offense to Pi Fi we're kind of <laughs> we're kind of past that so this was a $10 beach towel and it is six feet long. And I thought it was cute, so we have that for the weekend. Hoping I get to use it because it's supposed to storm on Saturday and Saturday's our only beach day that we have. Moving on, in no particular order other than by bag, this is how we're gonna do this. First we have some eggs and I only bought six because there's no need to buy a dozen when I was leaving. Then I got some blueberry English muffins. I used to get these all the time in college and then I randomly stopped. I think it's like I could not find them anywhere. Like they only have the cinnamon flavor and I'm not a big cinnamon fan. So we finally got these. So it's kind of like a 
Not a nostalgia thing, but kind of. Then I bought some tampons because I ran out. Then I bought some Ritz crackers, to snack, like the little snack packs, because this is what I use to snack on my chicken salad that I make, which I'll get to later on. It's either that or those, you know, the club crackers, like the rectangle club crackers. Now this is nostalgic, okay? We have some Uncrustables. You might be like, what the heck, Maddie, what is this? This is just going to be a quick little snack if I want one. I used to eat these all the time in like elementary school, middle school, sometimes high school. Like they're just so, they're the perfect size. They're good, they're yummy. Say less. Next bag. We have toilet bowl cleaners. I went to get this last time and I forgot. Um, they're the things that you like put in like the actual tank of the toilet and it turns the water blue. It's not a grocery, but that's okay. Then I got ranch dip seasoning stuff. And I'm so excited for this because I saw a girl on TikTok put this, like the seasoning mix in Greek yogurt, like plain Greek yogurt, and it tastes like ranch. And I thought that would be amazing to try. So updates to come on that. Marley. I have high expectations. I don't know, we'll see. And then I have canned chicken, and I know this is a very controversial thing. I know a lot of people are like, ew, canned chicken, that's disgusting, why would you ever eat that? Because I like it. It's easy for chicken salad, again, the, the Ritz crackers. Don't knock it till you try it. And each serving has 18 can, 18, 18 cans, 18 grams of protein. And they're like less than a dollar. Maybe they are, maybe a little more than a dollar. Just saying. And then I have cat food. I'm not gonna show you all that. I don't think that's anything interesting. We got PB2, I was running out of my powdered peanut butter. Then I got some dark chocolate chips and I forgot what this was supposed to go on top of. Oh, my chia pudding. <laughs> I got some popcorn kernels. Obviously I am a big fan of popcorn. I like cooking it on the stove top. I got more thinking I didn't have any of this. So now I have popcorn for days. I was really just trying to refill this because this was running low, but you know what? And then next we have some milk and I just like this milk because it has protein in it It's for my chia seed pudding <laughs> When I tell you I almost like audibly screamed in Walmart when I saw this. This was the last The last of all things poppy in Walmart and it's my favorite flavor and it was a case of them So I got four. Of I'm so excited <laughs> ah, It's the little things in life. Now if you know me, you're probably like Maddie, you don't like soda. You don't like carbonation. I know I froth out the carbonation. Poppy, if you're watching this, any customer, customer, any employee of Poppy, please make non-carbonated versions of this for the non-carbonated, for the people who don't like carbonation. Oh, so excited. Obviously, I really like orange flavored things. This just really spoke to me and I was like, I think I need that. So we got orange sherbet in a tube. I, I don't know. I don't know. Sounded really good, okay. And then I got some frozen pineapple as well as frozen strawberries and bananas for my smoothies and smoothie bowls. Because I have no more fruit left. I have, all I have is what's in here and I think it's just mangoes left and I hate mangoes so honestly, why not chuck it? Next we have some celery. I'm going to cut that up later to snack on with my ranch dip that I'm gonna make. Then I got some grapes to snack on as well. And cuties, one of my favorite fruits. There's an orange pattern going on, if you cannot tell. I like putting these in this little container. Next, I grabbed some bananas, and I only wanted three because I didn't want to grab like a whole thing and then not even use them. But those go on top of my smoothie. Probably gonna go on top of my chia pud sitting. But might go on top of my chia pud. Chia. What am I? Chia pud. Chia. Might go on top of my chia seed pudding as well. Then I got some lime. I feel like limes are just like a household staple that you need. Some strawberries. And then my favorite kind of apples, pink lady apples. Honestly, I, I say it's my favorite kind. I like all kinds of apples and I put them in this container as well. Y'all remember when I organized my fridge in my other apartment, like all of the containers, like it, it looked like a Pinterest fridge. Well, that didn't last long because the containers I used, I had to wash and they warped in the dishwasher. So now I don't have any of the containers left because I couldn't fix them. Like they're literally like all wonky. So that is why I don't have an aesthetic fridge anymore. I don't feel like buying new containers. <laughs> then I bought some carrots for my ranch dip and I got the carrot chips because I just figured they were easier for dipping and whatnot. Then I got some passion tea. I love getting this stuff because I mix it with lemonade. So it's my own passion tea lemonade. And, and this lemonade jug thing, just so cute. It was a dollar. I was like, yes, I want it. And then I got an Olipop. I'm just gonna try this. 
it's kind of like poppy it's, i feel like it's one of their competitors but this flavor is tropical punch so i'll do a little comparison on instagram or something last bath last bath laughing cow light cheese this is what i mix with the canned chicken to make chicken salad. It's so good. I know you usually use like mayonnaise and whatnot, but I like this version. Trust me on this one. It's my favorite cheese. Like even just for snacking, like just a little triangle with crackers. Oh, so good. Then I have some butter spray. I've been needing this desperately. Pure vanilla extract for my chia seed pudding. Um, I also like snacking on these mandarin oranges. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I feel like I'm gonna get so much heat and be like, what do you eat on a daily basis? I don't know, I don't know. And last, but certainly not least, Greek yogurt. I feel like there's just so many things you can do with this, like the plain Greek yogurt. Hello? I think I wanna try the ranch dip now, actually. I'll show you guys how to do it, and I guess I'll try the Olipop as well. Actually, I kinda have the passion tea lemonade right now. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. That's the way, uh-huh. I like it, uh-huh, uh-huh, that's the way, uh -huh. I like it, uh-huh, uh-huh. I guess I could just show y'all a few recipes. This might just like go into recipes, healthy recipes that I eat. Not what I eat in a week, but you know, we'll just throw some food making things in here. dip i did water it down a little bit to give more consistency of ranch and not like yogurt you know i don't know if i put enough seasoning in it because that's for two cups of like either sour cream or greek yogurt so that's a good snack and then for my chicken salad i'm gonna get a little square of or square <laughs> What is the shape? Triangle of laughing cow cheese. Okay, this is my dinner before, I have a dance class tonight, so this is my dinner before. And then one can of the chicken. I cannot open this can of chicken for the life of me. I mean, I am Hulk. Why was that so dang difficult? I'm just going to kind of shred the chicken. So the reason why I make it this way, this was actually an imitation like buffalo chicken dip recipe but i kind of like using it as like a chicken salad sort of thing and then mash in the cheese season it we got pepper garlic salt lemon pepper flaky salt hello you smell chicken you have you have chicken over there i got you some honey this isn't, what? what do you want? I got you food. And here we have our dinner. <laughs> A little snack plate. Carrots, celery, grapes, Ritz crackers, chicken salad, ranch. Yum! <laughs> oh, and then my passion tea lemonade, oh. Oh my god, it's so good. I think it's better than the Starbucks one. All right, guys, that is the end of today's video. Hopefully this inspired some healthy recipes if y'all were looking for that or whatever it was. But I hope y'all enjoyed, and I'll see you guys in my next video.